Welcome to KOL Now News. Amazing releases this week, including Espa's debut song, BTS new album, and new K-drama, Live On. On November 17th, SM Entertainment brand new four-member girl group Espa debuted with the single Black Mamba. This track features avatar version of each member which might also be implementing during their promotional stages. The song is about the member's identity and the connection with their AR avatars. Produce 101 and 101 Spark Ji Hoon also released the first OST called Midnight for Kakao TV's new drama Love Revolution. It was already revealed that the song was in the works on October 15th of this year, but it was released recently on November 19th, accompanying the theme of the drama. The song is about a regretful breakup and the reminiscence of the memories with that significant other. On November 6th, YG Entertainment, very own treasure, released the single of the third single album, The First Step, Chapter 3, which talks about being in love and treasuring the person that you're in love with. The video showcases incredible hip-hop choreography and visuals from all the members. On November 18th, Big Hit Entertainment announced their acquisition of Odyssey Co's company, Co's Entertainment. The message and values of the two companies were found to be similar and sharing the same passion for discovering new talented artists. After acquiring shares in Gladys Entertainment and Source Music, the company continues to grow its list of acquisitions. On November 20th, BTS released their new single, Life Goes On, as well as their new album, B. Fans have been especially awaiting the release of it as it was announced in October that the album will be produced from scratch by the group themselves. Tune in for a special review on our channel. Live On scheduled every Tuesday at 9.30pm on JTBC featuring Jung Dabin, Min Hyun from US. Heko Rang is a high school student. Due to her pretty appearance, she has gained popularity on social media and at her school, yet only has one friend due to her condescending personality. One day, she encounters a problem. She learns that someone is trying to unveil her secret. To find that anonymous person, she joins her high school broadcasting club with Go Tech, chief of the club. The Goddess of Revenge premieres on November 21st on Saturday and Sunday at 9 p.m. on TV Joseon with Kim Sarang, Yoon Hyun Min, and Yoo Soo Yi. Kang Hye Ra used to work as a reporter. She did not receive recognition for her work, but she married a celebrity. She is now the hottest influencer in South Korea, but she becomes involved in a fake scandal. Overnight, this leads her descending into a bottomless pit, which she now seeks revenge for. Our webtoon highlight for this week is the remarried empress by Alpha Tart. It's the story of perfect impressed Navier Eli Trovi who one day is faced with the terrible reality of her husband bringing home a mistress and demanding a divorce. She accepts under one condition that she has the permission to remarry. Our food highlight of the week is Pyongyu, also known as Mandarin Oranges. Jeju has been famous for its harvesting of Mandarin even dating back decades ago when they were offered exclusively to the king. Jeju has a whole Mandarin museum in Sogwipo and even offers a harvesting experience where you can not only pick the food but also make jam and different dishes containing it. Oh, it's ceremony season is one of the most exciting events happening each year in Korea. However, due to COVID, all ceremony will take place online. The Fact Music Award will be held on December 12th, MAMA on December 5th, the MMA is from December 2nd to the 5th, and SBS Kayo Tejan is on December 25th, featuring incredible lineups such as BTS, TWICE, and Seventeen, to name a few. Facebook launches new chat feature with animated BTS characters, Teeny Tan. The group's very own animated characters known as Teeny Tan made their debut a few months ago and have now taken the world by storm. The chibi version of the member have made their way into the Facebook world being able to apply their theme on chat as well as a unique AR experience with them in the background. Put on your party hat, here are next week's idol birthday so you won't forget. And that's all for this week's news report. Thanks for watching. Comment down below your favorite news of the week. You can also follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and TikTok. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for even more exciting news about Korean culture. See you again next Friday.